if you just got your dbrand iphone 13 skin relax this is going to be easy first wipe your device free of dust and fingerprints for optimal results ensure you're under bright lighting note that your dbrand skin comes with up to three elements back frame, and camera. Each purchase comes with not one, but two different types of back skins. A microfiber cloth is also included to help smooth down the edges. You will require a hair dryer for this installation, so pause the video now and go grab one. Welcome back. Don't worry if your exact device isn't shown the procedure is identical for all models. Let's begin with the camera. Apply the camera skin using an oven. Let's move on to the back piece. As mentioned earlier, there are two different types of back skins included with your order, precision fit and standard fit. The standard fit offers a super simple installation and is designed to be used in combination with the frame skins. The precision fit is tougher to apply, but wraps around all sides and corners of the device. To install the precision fit, Jump ahead to the time shown on screen. For the standard fit instructions, just keep watching. You selected the standard fit. Let's get started. Remove the skin from the 3M paper and reattach as shown. Align around the camera cutout, ensuring that the skin is perfectly aligned along both exposed corners. Once lined up flawlessly, Apply pressure to the exposed portion. Next, rotate the paper, reattach as shown, and turn the phone upside down. Align the bottom of the skin to be perfectly straight against your iPhone's glass edge. If you find that the bottom of the skin is crooked, it means that the top two corners were not aligned properly. To fix this, gently remove the skin and try again. Once lined up perfectly, apply pressure to secure the skin in place. You may now remove the 3M paper entirely and smooth out the back surface. Finally, heat the area surrounding the camera. Then apply pressure to form the skin around the camera housing. Once applied, your camera should look like this. Let's move on to the frame skins. Note that each set of frame skins comes with two pieces, top and bottom. Begin with the bottom piece. Be extra gentle when removing the frame pieces from the 3M paper, otherwise they may stretch. To prevent this, Peel the skin bit by bit, readjusting your grip as you go. Once the skin has been removed from the 3M paper, align the center portion of the skin using the lightning port and speaker cutouts. Once aligned, apply pressure along the bottom edge to secure the skin in place. Continue wrapping the skin around the corner ensuring that the SIM tray cutout is aligned properly. Repeat for the opposite corner. Next, let's install the top frame piece. Align around the volume and toggle cutouts as shown. Next, wrap the skin around the corner bit by bit ensuring that the skin remains aligned with the frame of your iPhone. 
Continue wrapping the skin until you've reached the opposite side. Finally, apply one more round of pressure to secure the skins in place. At this point, you may be noticing a sharp edge along the border of your iPhone. Let's take a moment to smooth it down. Grab your microfiber cloth and rub each edge 10 to 15 times. This friction will soften any sharp edges, making the skin feel like it's melting into your iPhone. Done. If you have any questions, you know how to reach us. You selected the precision fit. Let's get started. Remove the skin from the 3M paper and reattach as shown. Align the skin around the charging port and speaker cutouts. Once lined up perfectly, apply pressure to the bottom of the skin. The next step is very important. Follow it carefully, otherwise your skin may end up looking like this. Heat the bottom of your skin and apply firm pressure, bit by bit, until the entire exposed portion is stuck down. This will ensure that a crease forms around the bottom edge of your iPhone. Next, remove the 3M paper and align around the camera housing. Once aligned, apply pressure to smooth out the back surface. Once smoothed out, grab your hair dryer and heat the top flap until the material becomes soft. Once heated, wrap the skin around the top edge by applying pressure from one side to the other. Apply one more round of heat and pressure to the bottom edge to secure the skin in place. Next, heat the area surrounding the camera, then apply pressure to form the skin around the camera array. Once applied, the camera should look like this. Now, turn your attention to the left side of the skin by heating up the side flap. Once heated, wrap the skin around the frame of the device from the center outward, ensuring you take extra care around the side button cutout. Repeat this process for the right side of the skin. Finally, let's apply the corner flaps. The key to getting a seamless installation is by applying the flap so that the corner, highlighted here, meets the inner edge of the flap, highlighted here. Grab your hair dryer and heat the exposed flap until it becomes soft. Wrap a small portion of the skin around the corner with your thumb. Continue heating and applying until the flap has been fully wrapped around the corner. If the flap isn't aligned correctly, just peel it back, heat it up, then try again. Any remaining bumps or wrinkles can be smoothed out by heating the corner of your device and rubbing with your microfiber cloth. Repeat this process for the other three corners. Chances are you won't remember all those instructions, so jump back to the time shown on screen. 
Once complete, the corners should look like this. At this point, you may be noticing a sharp edge around the border of your iPhone. Let's take a moment to smooth it down. Grab your microfiber cloth and rub each edge 10 to 15 times. This friction will soften any sharp edges, making the skin feel like it's melting into your iPhone. Done. If you have any questions, you know how to reach us.